Good evening, everyone. I'm Paul Oster, and I'm from Mayday Saxonvale. I'm not sure if you've heard, but we'd very much like to purchase the Saxonvale site in Froome from you, and I'd like to explain why. Acquiring the whole site in Saxonvale in 2018 was an ambitious and optimistic act by the Council, but the ACORN plan does not match that ambition. Grids of five-storey apartments in the last major town centre site for employment and community facilities is not what Froome needs. Our town council, the civic society, the chamber of commerce and residents have all objected. The local experts have explained in detail why it is the wrong plan for Froome. Yet the scheme is being pursued regardless. This might be explicable if there was no alternative. But Froome has come forward with an alternative. It isn't some sketches, a wish list or some dreamy ideas. It is an outline planning application currently awaiting determination. Mayday's alternative plan does exactly what ACORN's scheme fails to do. It fully extends the town centre. It creates a wide range of employment space that your plan for Froom demands. It has policy compliant levels of affordable housing. It has facilities and assets for our community. The community have voiced their support for the Mayday plan as strongly as they rejected ACORN's, including over 1,000 residents comments in support. And the Mayday plan is funded, viable and deliverable. It is the most economically advantageous plan for Froome and for Mendip District Council. We can facilitate the best consideration for the land. It will generate far higher economic impacts, long term council revenue and community well-being. We are aligned with Stories, our socially responsible development partner, on maximising the community offer, not profit. It is because we are not constrained by an obligation to deliver the highest possible return on capital that we can lower costs and deliver more. Development at scale is always uncertain, but the fundamentals of our model mean it will always deliver the most for our community. We will send you a paper which sets out our financial approach in more detail. To date, you have not engaged with us. We invite you, the governing cabinet, to sit down with us. To all other councillors of all parties, and especially those from Froome, you cannot reasonably be silent on an issue so fundamental to Froome's future. At the upcoming elections, voters will expect you to explain your position. To members of the Planning Board, per the Localism Act, you can fully express your views on the two plans for Saxonvale and still join the Planning Board with an open mind and not be predetermined. We will send you legal advice that sets this out in more detail. The community you serve has spoken clearly. Your constituents have seized the initiative to find a way forward. If you ignore them, what is the result? Apathy, disillusionment, the slow demise of Froome. Alternatively, you can breathe life into local democracy. Join with us and let's be ambitious, be optimistic and believe in Froome. It's your choice. Thanks for listening. Thank you, Mr. Oster.